Our protein choices are changing, including everything from the burger you grill to the snacks you eat. One of the foods that sits at the front of the plant protein revolution is the field pea. Let's take a look at all the ways CFANS is shaping the future of pea protein. Our researchers are working hard breeding different varieties of winter and spring peas in our greenhouses. The peas need lots of sunlight, water, and monitoring to make sure they progress properly. The scientists grow hundreds of lines in order to find just the right one to plant in the fields. Once selected, the peas are grown in variety trials to see which ones do best under certain conditions. In addition to being grown as a protein source, the Forever Green Initiative is testing peas as a cover crop. They stay green through the winter, providing nutrients and preserving the soil during the colder seasons. After the harvest, the peas need to be cleaned and sorted. They run through a thresher to remove any hulls or other waste and are bagged up for further testing and processing. At the Plant Protein Innovation Center, scientists use a variety of tools and experiments to test the peas. They extract protein from pea flour and measure the structure and functionality of that protein. The protein isolates that are extracted in the lab are then scaled up in the pilot plant. The plant workers separate the pea protein and process it as an ingredient for use in a variety of foods, including snacks, alternative meats, and beverages. Before the pea protein products go to market, they have to be tested for appearance, aroma, taste, flavor, and texture. That's where the sensory center comes in. Here, expert tasters evaluate these qualities and make notes. This information is used to improve foods before they are commercially available. When the foods are finally ready for production, companies use research and development processes to fine tune the characteristics of foods that consumers will enjoy. Foods like burgers and egg substitutes have to taste good, but the look and feel of them is just as important. So the next time you bite into a veggie burger or a pea protein snack, take a second to think about where it came from there's a good chance that CFANS had a little something to do with it.